Um, so thanks so much. So thanks so much for having me today. Uh, my name is Elena Cater, and I am here from Completing the Puzzle. And if you have not heard of us, that's okay. Um, so we started in April of 2020 as a side hustle um, by two avid puzzlers with tech backgrounds. So I actually at the time was working for a company called Blackbaud. Um, I've worked in product management for about 10 years and my partner, um, he's actually my fiance, um, had been working, running his own digital agency. Um, and uh, he specifically um, worked and focused on subscription box companies. And so he did all the technical and marketing um, for a bunch of different subscription box companies. And so it was like the end of March in 2020, COVID had just hit, we were supposed to take a trip and, um, and instead we couldn't, and he had actually gotten a puzzle for us that was where we were supposed to go. And so we were doing the puzzle and as we were putting the puzzle away, it was a really nice expensive puzzle. I just mentioned to him, man, it's such a shame that, um, that we're just gonna put this puzzle in a closet and, and not do it again. It's just gonna take up space or we'll go donate it or something like that. And, so we kind of got to thinking, man, is there not any sort of puzzle exchange or puzzle rental? We Googled and there wasn't anything really like that out there. So in April, we launched Completing the Puzzle um, and we aim to provide a fun, hassle-free and sustainable puzzle, puzzling experience um, through a puzzle rental subscription service. Um, as a company, we try to create a culture of empowerment and ownership. Um, we think that's super important and, um, you know, we're small, but we are growing. And as we grow, we know that we can't do everything ourselves. We can't be everywhere at all times. And so it's really important that we empower our employees and our team to make decisions. Um, we trust that they will make good decisions um, and that they own the decisions that they make too. And, um, you know, that's something that um, we found really good success with so far. So just a little bit more about completing the puzzle and how it works. Um, so our customers come into the website, they pick their level. So um, number of pieces, um, they can pick their preferences. So different themes, and then we send them a puzzle. They they complete the puzzle and then using a prepaid um, mailing label, they send it back to us and then we send them a new puzzle. So it's really simple. Um, we take out a lot of waste that exists with puzzles today where people are constantly having to buy new ones, which we really love. We just switched to compostable mailers. So um, that's really cool. And we actually um, donate a portion of every sale to a, um, a nonprofit that plants trees. So we really believe in sustainability and make it a part of our, of our company. So we are hiring a couple of positions right now. We're looking for a social media and marketing intern. This is a paid position at $15 an hour. And I just wanted to be really clear about that because um, even though you're not supposed to have unpaid internships, I know that some still exist out there, um, but we are looking for someone to help us create a marketing campaign calendar for email and social, and then actually create the content as well. We're really looking for someone creative, positive, and who will be able to complete work on deadlines. Um, not necessarily that we always set, but that we set together, being mindful that you are, you know, have school, you have other deadlines, you have life. And so we, we are, I think, pretty reasonable. Um, we estimate that this would probably be 10 to 20 hours per week. Um, we do ask for experience and knowledge of Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Um, so we do most of our um, most of our customer acquisition and engagement through social media right now, um, and we're really looking for um, you know really upping our game, especially with with TikTok. Um, we're also looking for someone with strong writing skills. Um, and although it's not necessarily, uh, or not necessary, excuse me, knowledge of video and photo editing would be a huge plus um, in being able to create the visual content um, that's beautiful as well. Um, you don't have to have done anything like this before. Um, you know, this is definitely something that, um, you know, we're, we're willing to, to train on some of this 
Um, but definitely looking for someone with a really creative um, attitude, um, willing to try new things and just, um, and really positive. And then the other role that we're currently hiring for, oops, is for puzzle cleaning and shipping. Um, this role is $12 an hour and it's a very flexible role. So you can set your own hours up to 40 per week between the hours of 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. And even we do have some um, hours available on Saturdays, so between 10 and 3. And um, this is where, so when the puzzles come back to us, we have puzzle cleaning machines that, um, that we made that are proprietary because we obviously want to make sure that the puzzles get cleaned in between uses, get any potential dust or you know pet hair or anything out. So we have um, some, some machines that we created for this purpose. Um, and so have to clean all the puzzles and then um, put them back into, um, into the spots where they belong so that they're ready to get shipped out again. Um, and so we're looking for help here. It is a job where you can listen to podcasts or music, or maybe even you have recorded lectures that you need to listen to for your classes. Um, so this is something where you can, you know, put, put in uh, earbuds while you work um, or even have your, your laptop up and um, have that going while you work. But we would be looking for someone who is attentive to detail, um, is able to see when maybe a puzzle needs to be retired because the pieces are starting to fray or looking a little used. Um, and the only thing here really, we re just request that a two week schedule be set two weeks in advance, just so that we can plan around your schedule and make sure that all the puzzles will be able to get cleaned. We are located in Southeast Austin. So um, right off of 71, just you know, conveniently off of 35 in between 35 and 183. And if you are interested in applying for either of these positions, oops, let's see. Well, it's not going to my last slide, but you can email me. Well, for some reason it's frozen. I apologize for that. Oh, there we go. Um, you can email your resume to me, um, Elenia at completingthepuzzle.com and just please specify which role you're applying for. Um, and I'd love to hear from you. Um, and, uh, and also if you have any questions, I'd be happy to take them.